And I'm Juan Logan. I'm a painter, sculptor, printmaker, and those kinds of things. And I make public art as well. Well, we can start with the heads of humanity. You know, the idea behind that was to really deal with the notion of uh, all the people that participated in this process, uh, the sort of long struggle for freedom and those that were participating during that period. And so we have these heads, and they're in all manner of heads in terms of both scale and in color. And I think that's really, really important to make note of the fact that, you know, the participants you know, sort of crossed over all those boundaries. You know, they were not limited to just two African Americans, that we all as a nation have been fighting for this, you know, a long, long time. And I think the struggle continues today. So when we were designing this during the <coughs> conceptual phase, uh, we wanted to include boulders. Um, and we wanted to include boulders in addition to the seat walls as seating opportunities for people visiting the walkway. But we also- But also as obstacles. You know, because the, that pathway has always been you know, cluttered, if you will, with many, many obstacles. Uh, and this is a way of representing that and talking about it. The thing that was also interesting was the, uh, all of the many, many layers of paint that remained here. And we felt it was so important to leave that because it talked about the, the layers of history that this building represents. Uh, there was a Woolworth building here that I think we caught fire in the 30s. Um, and it had been covered up for many, many years. But even so, you know, you're left here with the dry goods uh, sign here, all the way down to where the, the Coca-Cola signs are located. We felt it was a wonderful way to not only preserve history uh, in Rock Hill, or in about Rock Hill, but also to bring our new elements into this as well, uh, to talk about where we are today, where we have been, where we hope to go in the future. And this building, you know, all of these elements working together sort of talk about that and represent that we believe in a very wonderful way. And, you know, above me uh, was the word fatigue. And I always thought it was really interesting that that was part of the signage on, already on the building because can you imagine working, you know, struggling for freedom for 400 years plus? You know, just how tired you would be after all those years it just seems so appropriate. Mm -hmm.